Please step back, how five step back, step up, 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 beep, up. We were expecting Leon to be a grandchild who came on a weekend, not five minute warning, you've got to have him off foster care, which is what we got. Uh, them two were my old parents, and and there was, and and they couldn't care for me, and that's me. We've known since he was born there was a chance he would have autism, um, but he got officially diagnosed last June. Oh, wow. Okay, Bobby. He's a joy. He's loving, but then he'll go. I hate you when I want to live somewhere else. And I know if I needed, if it got really bad, I could ring grandparents plus and say, well, can somebody actually tell me what to do with this situation? Like, I'm an ex-teacher, and I've done autistic training, worked with kids in foster care, so we're all their problems. But when it's yours and in the house, you need that support because everything goes out the window. Uh. Testing, testing. The welfare officer at school put in place a contact with the Grandparents Plus to come along and basically let us know what activities and support they could give to us. Grandparents Plus are there just to help you. Yeah. If you want advice, they're there. Mm -hmm. If you want support, they're there. Yeah. If you want a shoulder to cry on, they're there. We're going to Colour Courts Beach for the children to meet each other and kinship carers to meet each other and have fun, basically. There's various terms that are used, kinship carers, connected persons, family and friends carers. It really describes a family member or a friend who's stepped in to care for a child when the parents are unable to care for them. I don't want to touch anything. Grandparents Plus hopes to work with kinship carers to make sure that they don't feel alone, that they meet others who are in the same position and that they have access to good quality support and advice and information. It's making sure that people know what they're entitled to and are informed about their rights so that they can make decisions. We want to provide services that support the family throughout the whole journey really from, from being a young child through to adulthood. People often don't know anybody else who's in the same position, so going to a support group has been described as a light bulb moment, meeting others who understand. There's always somebody who's been through something similar, so that learned, lived experience, really. Uh, do you want to come in the water with me if you want to? Uh, 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 that sounds amazing. I've got a little bit of work to do first. It's a support of Grandparents Plus. Through that group, it saved my life, to be honest. It was talking to somebody else, somebody else cared. You didn't feel so isolated. There's nothing out there for kinship kids as yet, but it's on the process with Grandparents Plus.